Okay, we are playing Fallout New Vegas. I'm starting all my game over. Uh, I'm sure this is going to be lots of fun since this game will crashes about every 20 seconds. I also started playing this again because of the fact that my little brother, my little brother who's 30, <laughs> actually had talked about running through the wasteland of DC the other day. You know, if you follow the series, you know, that's Fallout 3. This is the fourth installment, Fallout New Vegas. I love this shot. Every headshot you do should have to if you cut to a quick one like this, that'd be awesome. Just look all computerized like that. I like this game. This game relieves frustration like mad. And whenever somebody pisses me off, I can count on this game to unupset me. War. War never changes. Of course it doesn't. When atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic dedicated to old-world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world, and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam just barely against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House, and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to Me? the New Vegas I'm a courier. Strip. I'm a courier. Okay, I'm a courier. What seemed like a, a simple a delivery job time. has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink, dig? You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. No, it doesn't. Oh, ow! Damn it!
Okay, welcome to your suite. I have all kinds of mods in here. So it'll take us like 20 minutes just to get through all of these. If you're going to play this game, I would suggest you go to the Nexus Mod Manager and check out all, or Nexus Mod, Nexus Mods, you know, it's a website that's got all kinds of user created mods and it is an awesome website. They have all kinds of tools to help play the game, help mod your game, help add new things. Uh, almost some things almost expansion pack size now oh, it's an awesome site and all of it is user created uh, this game has an unstable nature to it so uh, yeah they got a lot of stuff that helps kind of clear it up a little bit but one of the things I suggest the first thing you get with this is a program called chasm it's a thing that makes it so your game auto saves correctly you know because otherwise this game you know it just blows up every now and then and I'm sure you'll get to see so here we go we'll run through all the things I have to add and you know different stuff that I have mods Increased wasteland spawns, which I don't know if I want to run with recording software going at the same time. But okay, they're going to be talking here in a minute. You're awake. How about that? Whoa, easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second, get your bearings. Let's see what the damage is. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? Okay, my name. Um, yeah. Dar Onion. If any of you have ever seen Three Musketeers, read Three Musketeers, whatever, you know, you'll know that one of the Three Musketeers' name is D'Artagnan. Oh, well, this is, yeah. Anyway, keep going. I can't say it's what I'd have picked for you, but if that's your name, that's your name. I'm Doc Mitchell. Welcome What's up? to Good Springs. Yeah, now, no problem. I hope you don't mind. But I can get shot I in the head in your town. I around there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. How'd I do? Okay, well, he's, wow, he's awesome. But no, let's see if we can fix that situation here. No, no, Ew. All right, let's try start with him and customize actually back let's randomize yes I said randomize why do I have to re reconfirm it all right let's see if we can get something close to what I want here I'm a kind of chubby dude with the puggy nose and yeah, we'll start with him and I'm I'm old so I'm not that old so. all right now Go on to the next hairstyle. Let's see. I usually go for this one. Wow, you can really see the colorization in that. It gets out of frame a little bit. Now yeah, look, look, it's all rainbowy. Anyway, all right. That's what I usually have my hairstyle as. Um, color. usually go with this or this. So I'm going to go with this one this time. Facial hair. What do I want to look like? I'll say more stuff from 
mods. No, get that off there. Uh, rough beard. Yeah. Let's see, I'm old. Just got shot in the head. Not feeling too well. Let me go back to face. That is not my face. Customize. Shape. General. And on the heavier side. Gonna move this one this way. Kind of a big head. Forehead, you can't really see now, but I'm gonna move this this way. Um, tall or short? I have a tall forehead. Do I have a tall forehead? I don't know. I don't know. Why is it moving the ones up there? I put that there because that's where I wanted it. Leave it alone, man large eyes. How big do we have eyes get? Little eyes. Big eyes. Alright. Got kind of a big nose. Jesus. Maybe that's the way it is. Nose. I got a size. Your crap is too wide, man. Nostrils wide, thin. That makes them wider, that makes them thinner. Alright, nostril tilt. What does that control? Oh, there we go, here. Make it a little puggy. Kind of flat. Move it down just a little. Cellian height. Oh, I want that down. And make it a little longer. There we go. Bridge depth. Oh wow! Yeah, honker. Okay, back up. Yeah, everything else moves around when you do that. Like I set something somewhere. I want to stay there. Hey, back. Mouth. Oh, the mouth looks alright. I guess he's got kind of an overbite here. We'll bring this this way. And I got kind of a big mouth. Cheeks. Convex concave. That's not a cheek, that's a jaw. The jaw's moving. This damn high. I'm down a little bit. Give him a saggy face. Alright, jaw. I got me a big old wide jaw. Retracted or jutting? Hi, hey. hey, how are you doing? Okay. Messenger's going off. You know, somebody told me the other day you shouldn't use Facebook Messenger because they can track this and that and all kinds of stuff. I'm like, well, yeah, that's what the internet does, man. It tracks all that crap. He has a goofy looking chin. Let's move that forward. And then broad and recessed. Let's, let's try to put that down to try and cover up my. Okay, stop it. On the damn game, man. Come on. Now watch the game, not you being stupid. Oh, maybe you won't watch me being stupid. That's fine. Um, I have yet to change my eye color. Is it in this eye color here? Okay, now these. There's all kinds of eyes. I can't remember what pack or what mod does this, but they have some crazy eyes in this. Gray. Mine are usually gray. I usually go with these right here. But you know, we'll go through all of them. Let me check all these out. Got some crazy looking eyes in this man. 
violet blue light his pupils look like that dude has been on some drugs let's see here Look at that. that's crazy all right let's go back up to mine let's see my name gray 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 right here that's me well maybe all right apparently my pupils don't dilate either all right so back back next and okay well, that's me that's pretty much you should go make yourself fat i want to be fat and run into the wasteland well, I got most of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Okay, no sense keeping you in bed anymore. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine there. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. All right, I'm trying to do Facebook Messenger and do this at the same time. Okay. Okay, so. Look around here. There's all kinds of stuff. See, look at this. I'm going to go ahead and take this gun. Look real close. There's actually a gun right here, too. Okay, Ooh, Vigor Tester. So far. Go ahead and give the Vigor Tester a try. Really? You have a weird mustache. Right quick if you get back all your faculties. And you look like you have a comb over, but you're bald. Okay, I'm confused about that. Uh, all right let's see here you get five points to distribute and you can also take some away so see I can if I don't want to be so strong see I can just get rid of that I'm a noodle I'm a wet noodle but I like being strong because of the fact that it is hard to play this game and carry around a bunch of stuff Charisma, we'll drop that one one. There'll be ways to fix it later. My intelligence, I'm a knucklehead. Yeah, well that's about right. Agility. Strong. I want to be agile too. And the most important one, luck. Let's say. He'll say something crazy like that's a pretty average score or some stupid shit. Okay, so there is my results. Let's see what he says. You gonna say something stupid? I know you. With luck like yours, I'm surprised them bullets didn't just turn right around and climb back into the gun. Well, we know your Ooh. vitals are good. I actually heard that but one that before. That don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nuttered in a bighorn or dropping. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through a couple of questions? Uh, all right. See if your dogs are still barking. But why is it so dark in here? You all got lights, man. Turn them up. Just so we're clear, this is going to be a not safe for work playthrough. Because there is a bunch of... Well, this game is just annoyingly crazy anyway. So, Alright. Yeah, you know, notice I'm the gonna new say person back here. I want you to say the first thing that comes to mind. Dog. Um... Cat. House. None of these matter because you can change them around anyway. Um, yeah. Night. Where's day? Let's see the opposite of everything. Silence. Bandit. Right Swiss cheese. Light. Mother. Um. Okay. Now, I got a few statements. Your eyes I want are you creepy, to tell me dude. how much they sound like something you'd say. First one conflict just ain't in my nature. Oh. Disagree. I ain't given to relying on others for support. Agree. 
I'm always fixing to be the center of attention. Oh, well, hell, definitely. I'm slow to embrace new ideas. Um, agree. I charge in to deal with my problems head on. Um, sure. Almost done here. What do you say you have a look at this? Tell me what you see. Um... Two headed Okay. Eight. How about this one? <laughs> yeah. Last one. Last one. Um, garden gnomes. A garden gnome? I see garden gnomes. Two bears high fiving. Well, that's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have a look at the results. See if it all seems right to you. It won't. Okay, so from that, he was able to deduce that. I should get a tag skill and speech, unarmed, and melee weapons. No. None of that. Well, maybe speech. Oh, and guns and explosives. Yeah, we'll go for speech. I'll, I'll do speech. Okay. Uh, done. Before I turn you loose, I need one more thing from you. Really? You got a form for you uh, to fill money? out so oh, you okay. get a sense of your medical history. Just a formality. Ain't like I expected. to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. Okay, here is where we get to pick two traits. Now, each one of these has good things and bad things. You have to figure out what you want to do. It's been a long time to play this game, so I actually got to look and see what they're talking about here. We'll have a... I'll go for... good-natured... and... skilled. There. That helps raise up my skills immediately. But it also causes problems later. But, yeah done. All Go right, ahead. I guess that about does it. Come with me, I'll see you out. Well, no, because I got other things to do here, so I'm going to get up and... Hi, how are you? Hey, you're cute. This is part of the NCCS companions thing. I uh, actually built this one myself. For some reason, she's not starting with the clothes she's supposed to have. But, you know, I'm kind of cool with it. You know, so. Now she'll follow me. She's already got a gun, but she has no clothes. Yeah. I'm, yeah. Alright. So. I need to go over here to him. The dog to him to get some things here. Hi. Here, these are yours was all you had on you when you was brought in. Oh, yeah. I hope yeah. you don't mind, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find a next of kin, but it was just something about a platinum chip. Well, if you're heading back out there, you ought to have this. They call it a Pip-Boy. Uh-huh. I grew up in one of them vaults they made before the war. Mm -hmm. We all got one. Ain't much use to me now, but you might want such a thing after what you've been through. Oh, yeah, sure, thanks. I know what it's like having something taken from you. Yeah, like your hair. And put this on, too, so the locals don't pick on you for lacking modesty. Never was much my style, anyway. Okay, uh, thanks for patching me up. You shouldn't have gone through my stuff. What do I do now? Oh, thanks. I uh, don't mention it. You're good. It's I'm what good I'm here for. I have to do that, so. You should talk to Sunny Smiles before you leave town. Sunny she can help you learn to fend for yourself in the desert. Oh, She'll God, likely be at the saloon. I reckon some of the other folks at the saloon might be able to help you out, too. And the metal fella, Victor, who pulled you out of your grave. Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. Awesome. But try not to get killed anymore. Well, didn't mean to get killed the first time. Okay, I want to be in hardcore mode. Skip tutorial. They went that away. Now from right here, I am going to check 
make sure I'm in hardcore mode because for some reason, see, hardcore mode, off. I picked on. Okay, and while we're here, you got chasm, you want to make sure these three things are set to off. Because otherwise it'll start screwing up all kinds of stuff. So, yeah. So, continue. Alright, so now I have a pit boy I can actually turn on a light. Because it is freaking dark in his house. Okay, advanced recon armor, I want that. 